Hey, this is Lance Rahoff. I wanted to give you a quick update on what's going on around Arizona with Young Life as we've been expanding into some small towns. One of the things that happened a couple of weeks ago, it was really a lot of fun. We honestly didn't know how well this was going to work. We did a thing called a jump start. Uh, what we did was we got a group of the adult committee leaders in Casa Grande who said, let's spend one day and have multiple meetings um, over, over morning to evening with influential people in the community, people to connect with and different kinds of um, professions and so forth. And so in the morning, at like 9.30 in the morning, we had a coffee for pastors and we had about 13 pastors from local churches show up, including from Native American pastor who reaches kids out on the reservation. And that was an amazing meeting to hear their hearts and also how Young Life and churches, the local church partner together, they were super excited. At lunchtime, we had this lunch where we invited in community leaders and we had lawyers and attorneys. We had the warden of Eloy Prison there uh, who gave some great insight on just the prison and what goes on with kids. And oh my gosh, it was uh, so informative, but so good. They were super excited. Well, we got 15 to 20 minutes in front of the superintendent, uh, the principals at two high schools in Casa Grande, as well as key administrative staff uh, mid-afternoon. That We showed them the camp video for Lost Canyon. They were blown away. They were like, this is incredible. Uh, we would love to see this come to Casa Grande. And then we met with teachers at like 3.45 in the afternoon. Of course, teachers, uh, they were like, yes, this is what we need. It's a recurring theme that we're getting. But then at uh, dinner that night, the mayor and his wife, along with a school board member, came to dinner that night. The mayor stands up and says, um, we would love to see this come to Casa Grande. How can we help you? Uh, it's almost like you don't know how to respond to that when a city official, a mayor, a school district, a board member go, how can we help you get this launched? And so to, to say the least, we felt like the Lord's hand was in this every step of the way. Um, the Holy Spirit's been moving on people's hearts. The committee has come together. We're looking for an area director to hire for Casa Grande now, which is super exciting to just pray into that and say, okay, Lord, who do you have to come and uh, be on staff in Casa Grande? This is going to happen. Uh, the community's, the word is getting out for sure. And I'm excited about that. One other update in Payson, Payson Young Life is going to happen. We've been working on this for like a year and a half. We have this great group of adults. There's about three years of funding already in the bank to help support this ministry. Well, we just hired an amazing young guy named Hunter Barr to do to come on staff in Payson with Payson Young Life. Uh, Hunter's married to this amazing woman named Elena. We could not be more excited to have them as part of the Young Life community and on staff. He's already hit the road running. There's going to be kids going to camp at Lost Canyon this summer from Payson and uh, club and campaigners Bible study and, and Young Life Club is gonna be starting in the early fall. So anyway, I just wanted to give you that update and the Lord has just been making one divine connection after another with people had no idea who they were just months ago and now they're great friends because we're, we're just partnering together. That's what the Lord does in this ministry and I thank you for your partnership, your prayers, your financial support. Um, I mean, this ministry doesn't move without volunteers, with people praying and without people giving. And so I'm so thankful for the support that we're getting because we're gonna go and look for every kid. We're going after every kid in Arizona. And that means in the small towns and that means in the hard to fund areas and that means in the suburban areas as well. It's, it's about every kid. And so Lord bless you and I hope you have a great week. We'll be in touch soon. We have some amazing new vision that's coming your way, coming our way, coming to you too, about what's gonna go on in the next five years with Arizona Young Life. I can't wait to share that with you soon. Take care, bye-bye.